Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Today we'll be talking about why is the area of a parallelogram its base times height. On the left side here, we have a parallelogram. And we know that this is the height of the parallelogram. And this is our base. And the area of a parallelogram is equal to base times height. Now on the right, we have this rectangle. And of the, for the rectangle, this is the length of the rectangle. And right here, this is the width. And so we know that the area of a rectangle is length times width, right? But couldn't we write the length as the base of a rectangle? And wouldn't the width essentially be the height of a rectangle? So now that we make this statement, we can see that the area of a rectangle and the area of a parallelogram is the same. Now I'm going to show you guys that honestly blew my mind when I realized that this is possible. So here I'm taking a piece of this parallelogram and it's a triangular piece and I'm putting it on the left side of the parallelogram. And as you can see, when I take that triangular piece of the parallelogram and put it at the left side of the parallelogram, it forms a rectangle. And so this proves that the area of a parallelogram is equal to the area of a rectangle. If their base and height are the same. Thanks for watching this lesson. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, AlgebraStar, or visit AlgebraStar.com. Once again, thanks and stay safe.